So this is NTC's Industry 4.0 Smart Manufacturing Lab. Our Smart Manufacturing Lab actually has three sections to it. The first section is our Smart Manufacturing System that has FANUC robotics, it has smart sensors, vision cameras which guide our robots, basically any technology that you would find in our local industry. We have our flexible learning space in the center. Where individual courses take place. Individual courses are in areas such as collaborative robotics, vision using FANUC IR vision, smart sensors, HMI, PLC programming, everything that a student needs to succeed in the world of smart manufacturing. Our flagship, which is a lights out manufacturing line, that is a real live assembly line that students can analyze, um, investigate, and manufacture real products on. Our system actually builds and is a fully functioning manufacturing system that our students can learn from. One of the most exciting prospects of this new facility for me personally is that we can develop true cross-functional program projects with our students. That would encompass a mechanical design student who designs a new product and then we pass that to a manufacturing engineering student who can lay out the processes required to make the product uh, and then we can truly build that manufacturing process here in our lab from scratch custom and then we can have all our other students use the data from that. They can all get back together, they can work on improvement projects. It will truly be a live manufacturing system. Our students will build, they'll manage it, they'll tweak it. It's exactly what they're going to need to do in industry and that's exactly what our industry partners are looking for. So my experience at NTC has been nothing but, you know, great times. It's a small class environment. You get to work with the instructors one-on-one -on -one a lot of times. It's, it's a great facility. They have a lot of robots, a lot of you know, PLCs, a lot of technology that industry is using, and it's up to date. NTC really strives because they do have a lot of equipment, and it's easy to get hands-on instruction and real-world uses because you do have one thing to work on. It's not a simulation, it's hands-on. The reason we have FANUC robots here at NTC uh, is the reason a lot of people use FANUC robots. They're number one, especially in the Midwest. Uh, most of our local industries are using FANUC robots. They're reliable, they're easy to program. Everybody has them, so it's easy to train. So being a FANUC certified facility here, we we're able to offer that to local industries easy, and they appreciate us having that equipment. My favorite robot here in our lab is the CRX. It's the white collaborative robots. The technology that FANUC has came up with is impressive. It's, it's a collaborative robot, so it runs until the point where it gets some type of interaction or force from the outside world, and it knows to stop. Collaborative robots, I believe, are the way of the, the robot of the future. They have the ability to work around people. Um, they have the ability to have one person program them. They're very easy to program. So you could have one skilled person programming a bunch of these robots to do tasks throughout your facility. And then the next day you can move those robots to another place in the factory or any facility to perform a different task. They're so versatile. Our local industries have adopted many of these robots already. A lot of them have said it's because we have them here and they saw them here at NTC first. You know, so that's why we have them is because we're trying to push the future. NTC invested a lot and advanced robotics and automation technology. And the reason we did this uh, was because our industry partners were very clear that that was a need. The expertise is just not there at the moment. Um, it's a growth industry. Our businesses continue to want to grow, but with the shifting demographics in our state, that isn't always possible in terms of increasing manpower. Where it is possible is using advanced technology to make their processes more efficient um, and, and gain that growth. Our students are able to use this technology and they're able to experiment with it, apply it in different ways with our industry partners in many cases and that means they're able to go to our partners as employees and use those skills and the knowledge that they've gained at NTC to improve their businesses. Coming to the tech here I, I wanted to find a program that I could understand better on how things work. So the biggest need all of our industry partners are telling us is workforce. Uh, hiring skilled employees is incredibly difficult. 
With advanced technology is that need to have boots on the ground and you absolutely need to have skilled workers who have the right knowledge and the right experience to fix the problems that you will have in your manufacturing plant here uh, in your local area. So automation and uh, technology for automation has been around in manufacturing for a long time um, and it's been constantly innovated. Um, every manufacturer in the world is capturing data they just don't necessarily know what to do with it. Every manufacturer has been installing robots and robotic systems since the 80s, um, since that kind of all came around. Um, and again, they don't always know the best, most effective way to use that technology. And we are training our students to kind of act as that A to B, uh, the bridge, the link, um, whatever you want to call it, um, so that those employers can find that resource in their uh, own backyard, and then they can help them set that up efficiently. So a technical college is a great place to start and finish, or just start um, and continue your career. Technical college, everything is hands-on. Um, you're not going to get as much hands-on as you get at a university as you get here. Most of our, our teaching is done in a lab space, not in a lecture room. Um, class sizes are generally smaller. Our class sizes max out at 24 students. It's more personal. Uh, you get things you need. Um, you have qualified. Um, skilled faculty that worked in the field. Um, all around, I think, just a great opportunity for anybody who wants to learn about smart manufacturing. One of the amazing things I found when I started at NTC is actually about nine out of 10 of our students are employed by the time they get into their second semester of their programs, if not already employed when they start at NTC. Um, it's really a, an achievement that um, our students are so highly sought by, by employers. A lot of them are headhunted after they've joined NTC's programs um, and are then sort of supported as they go through their educational journey with us. Um, and that's just a huge testament to the, the skill and the, the local uh, enthusiasm we have with our students. It's a great deal for our students. They're getting paid while they're going to school, allowed to leave work to come to school. Um, it really shows a good partnership with our local employers. So one of the benefits we see um, from having students access all this latest and greatest technology uh, is that they are able to take that technology and then immediately use it to benefit their employer, wherever that may be. Um, we also appreciate that sometimes students are the ones that will go to a business and they'll be the ones that will drive the innovation. And that's not to say businesses are out of touch or that they don't have that capability already, but truly the next generation are going to bring fresh ideas. They've got a whole new way of looking at the world. We want to produce some excitement around smart manufacturing, Industry 4.0. Um, our students are excited, so we won. I guess we, we accomplished our goal.